Hey guys, I hope you are all well. Welcome to another one of my videos where I'm gonna show you a product that's definitely gonna help you. I must stress that this video hasn't been paid for or sponsored in any way. This is my own and honest review. In this video, I'm gonna to talk to you about beard oils. So for those of you that are trying to grow a beard or looking to grow a fresh beard, then this is for you. A few years back, I used to have a very, very long beard. And people used to ask me, whenever I used to go to shops or I used to go to people's houses or customers' houses, they used to ask me like, how do you grow your beard so long? And the trick is, my brothers, you have to maintain it. You have to look after it and you have to use a really good beard oil. You know, it does it. when you start growing it, it gets itchy, it gets frizzy and definitely you have to use a beard oil. So today I'm going to show you a beard oil. This product has been recommended to me by a very good brother. His name is Liakat Zaman from Roots of Knowledge. Brother Liakat, thank you very much for recommending this. Mashallah, your beard looks amazing. Your hair looks amazing as well. So I'm going to try to compete with you. But definitely, we're going to try this out today and let the viewers know how it smells and feels as well. So this particular product is called Jacks of London and it's from Amazon. And the particular fragrance is tobacco and vanilla. Now, I've had tried previously other brands of oils unfortunately I can't remember where I brought them from but because the brother had talked about it so much and uh, you know he said that really works for him we'll, we'll give it a try as well so let's get this opened up and again I've just uh, had a shower quite recently so my beard is kind of you know it's it's dry um, I had a bit of an incident uh, uh, a little while ago where I had a bit of a skin infection and I had to apply a strong cream so I had to cut my beard a little bit and because I trimmed it a little bit low, um, it just looked really silly. So I had to just trim it right down and just grow it back out again. So yeah, my skin condition is a little bit better now. As you can probably see, I've got a little scar on the side. And uh, yeah, I'm just trying to grow my beard back out and, uh, you know, trying to use this beard oil. So um, it's 50 milliliters um, and it cost me about 12.95, I think it was. So let's get this opened up. Okay, so let's, mm, that smells really nice. It's um, definitely you can smell the vanilla. I'm not sure about the tobacco, but yeah, I think the tobacco element, you know, is supposed to be subtle. So let's get this in the dropper. And the trick is you have to apply this um, after you've washed your face, you know, so the beard is like ready and primed. So get it in your hands, rub it together. It's quite thick you know other i've tried other oils and it's like water you put it on it just drips right down with this mm, that is really nice so the trick is get it in your hands and just rub it upwards into your beard okay just cover it all up and that feels so good because my beard is really really dry okay rub it into your moustache trying to grow a moustache as well you now my moustache is growing Quite a bit out from the side, so just rub that right in. Now, don't worry about getting it on your lips. It's a natural oil; it moisturises everything, you know. Yeah, work that right in. Okay, that's not looking good. Yeah, feels good. Yeah, that that's really softened my beard out really close when i came out the shower it was uh felt like you know those um brushes you get for the dustpan and brush my beard's really really thick Mashallah. so that's it done you know we can rub it into your skin as well so i've got that dry knuckles from the you know the winter weather rub it into your hands alhamdulillah so so this is not it what you guys really need now this is the bit people miss you know you've got it in your beard and you know you can use a comb and stuff like that's great but what you guys definitely need is a beard brush okay you get them in different sizes this one's got a handle on it as you can see but you can get them where it's just this bit here and what you need to do is after you put your oil on it's just comb or brush your beard in a direction you know you want it to grow right so you have to train your beard to grow. And this 
this is quite, it's not very hard, but it's not soft either. So you want to get a brush that, you know, it feels quite sturdy, but it's not going to like rip your skin. Again, just work that brush into your, into your beard. You know, I usually have a mirror in front of me, so I've got my, my monitor up there so I can see what I'm doing, you know, train that moustache as well. That feels so good because what it's doing at the same time is stimulating the skin underneath, right? The oil is penetrating into the beard and you're using this. I can actually, you know, as I'm doing this, my skin is like, um, it's, I can feel it. Um, how can I say tingling? Because I'm doing that, you know, and you do that sort of every morning and evening before you go to bed. So I wake up in the morning, have a shower, put beard all before you go out brush it up a little bit and again you don't have to spend that much amount of time as I'm doing now just quick bead oil and you know, work it up and if you have the time you can also you know after you get out the shower or bath or whatever you can get it like a comb and just brush your beard upwards so it sticks up so if you're looking for that kind of sharp full look just blow dry upwards put oil on and then just brush it down and that will train your beard to grow in that direction so for those brothers have always t told me that you know you've got patchy beards or your beard doesn't grow trust me just let it grow yeah don't cut it i've seen brothers right they've got like little patches on their beard and i'm like look don't cut it because what you want to do is let your beard grow on itself i've got patches on my beard my beard doesn't grow close together so if i cut my beard short now you'll see patches on my skin but i've just let my beard grow and because my beard's quite thick when it grows it just covers it even if you've got th a thin beard use beard oil and that goes in and it penetrates into it right same as your head hair as well you know why do people put oil on their hair it penetrates into the pores and you know it gives that that hair a fuller and healthier uh, look as well so i'm really really impressed by this jacks of london you know um like i said i've tried other beard oils and they've either given me um like a bad rash or sometimes you know none of them have like a, a scent and what i used to do when i used to have my long beard I used to kind of just get my beard and just just sniff it all day long you know i just know it's just got this nice uh, smell to it and you know people who you're around if you're in a room like this a small room your beard oil will, will give a uh, nice fragrance on people are like, what are you wearing you're like oh, i've got this beard oil you know and uh you know people may come up to you and smell your beard um so just be careful if it comes up to you uh, if it's your wife uh, it's great um if it's someone else i'd say look just recommend it this one as well so brothers uh unfortunately it's not for the sisters right again it's just for the brothers um do get this beard oil again beard is part of the sunnah so make sure you grow that beard out you know make it look good you know give you recognition as you know i would say not not in a very sexist or any kind of macho way but i believe a beard is is a man's identity and uh you know um i'm not saying if you don't if you don't have a beard you're not man but um you know a man you know i i believe in my personal opinion a beard is a man's signature if that makes sense so definitely uh give this uh, beard oil a try you won't be disappointed and like i said first impressions last i've not tried it before this is the first time and i'm well impressed as i'm speaking to you now i can i can smell the the tobacco and vanilla vanilla and tobacco so once again uh you know thank you very much uh, brother Liakat for uh, recommending and yeah, you know we should be catching our uh, beard competition up very soon so keep keep an eye out okay guys take care assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh